Hey, good morning everybody. It is Monday and you know what time it is. It's Music Monday at PoeticExpressions.com. So make sure you check out today's post, Bump It or Dump It, Explosive, Explicit, and Unexpected. And what I'm going to start doing on my site is every first Monday of the month, I'm going to be reviewing four songs that could be new songs, throwback songs you may have never heard before. And I'm going to give my opinion on them. Those four songs, you know, be it I like it, I don't like it, I hate it, I love it. I'm going to give you my raw and honest opinion on each of these songs. If you got to check out last month's Bump It or Dump It, it was called Vocal Wars Behind the Music, and I reviewed songs from Brandy, Maroon 5, Goody Mob, and Marvin Sapp. And on today's edition for the video, I'm only going to talk about Brian McKnight. Um, he's going to be the pretty much the biggest feature on the songs that I'm reviewing this week. and. We all know Brian McKnight for certain songs. Uh, basically, he's kind of like that clean-cut R&B guy. You know, we've heard him from such hits as Anytime, Crazy Love, uh, One Last Cry, you know, things like that. And he's really not one to do the kind of raunchy or uh, gut bucket, I guess you could say, R&B that you may find in some other artists, uh, maybe like R. Kelly or something like that. But he does have a new song that's out called If You're Ready to Learn, which was formerly titled Show Me How Your Works. And no, there's nothing wrong with your computer. I'm just not going to say that word on here. So again, it was called Show, Show Me How Your Works. And he changed the name of it to If You're Ready to Learn. I don't know if you've heard this song before. I'm not going to post the actual full song, but on my website poeticexpressions.com you'll get a chance to see him talking about how this song came to be and it's actually going to be used for an adult website so you can get a feel of what kind of song this is and what he's talking about I will say I was very very shocked that he even did a song like this and he's kind of lashed back out at the critics and he's saying that you know basically I guess his style of music or music period right now is not really paying the mortgage but you know my question is with record sales he may get a lot of sales from this single but you know who really makes money off of record sales anymore you know people burn songs they burn CDs so the artists I don't think would even see their full potential in record sales you know they seem like they make more money off of touring endorsements and things like that so I'm thinking he probably got a pretty nice check for letting this adult website use his song which uh, originally started off as a parody, kind of just a joke, and they picked it up, and now they're going to be using it. And the song has really taken off, and it's gotten him a lot of attention. Um, but it's gotten a lot of negative attention, too. But, you know, like some people say, negative attention is better than no attention. But he's never been that kind of artist to have that negative attention, like maybe a Lady Gaga, where they've gotten, you know, negative attention or flack for their image since the day they've been out. So... I don't know how that transition is going to work for him, for him being this clean-cut R&B artist to, you know, somebody that does push the envelope sometimes, maybe in certain songs, but never quite like this. I mean, he busts the envelope wide open on this one. So make sure you check it out. Check out my review, and I'm interested to see what y'all think about this song. Again, I think the song is uh, actually a pretty good song. I think the melody is nice. Um, it's just the video and the words to it, it just seems like it may backfire for him a little bit. I mean, if he goes on tour, I don't see him ever singing this song live on tour. But, hey, whatever that website paid him, that may be worth it. And whatever he's getting on royalties from the song, because you can actually buy it on iTunes, whatever he's getting from that, that may be worth it. So, who knows? But make sure you check out the review of that song. There's also going to be three other songs featured. So go to my website, www.poeticexpressions.com, and you can check out the full review there. And again, it's Bump It or Dump It, Explosive, Explicit, and Unexpected. So make sure you check it out, and let me know what you think.